Hello guys, in this video, I'm just going to explain how to fix this issue. I have just added this blueprint on the city level map. Okay, but when I'm trying to play right, it is wobbling. So I'm just using the controller as well. So here I am trying to play this C. It's wobbling, jittering and shaking heavily. Okay, uh, this is because of physics issue. Okay, I'm going to stop it pressing F8. I'm using Unreal Engine 5.2 in this demo. See how it is wobbling. Okay, before I fix the problem, I want to share this information. So these details is exist in GitHub. I'll be providing the link in the descriptions. Why this wobbling or jittering is happening because of the frame rate, okay? Because city level map is different frame rate, whatever we have created in the blueprint, that might be a different frame rate. So we need to match that. You can go through this document, frame rate independent physics. It says in UE4, but it is working in UE5 as well. So I fixed it. The simple step, I'm going to explain it. You can go through this document later. So you can see the sub steps, information, everything you can see it here. So basically I'm using this 120 Hertz monitor. I mean, 120 FPS monitor. So according to that, I'm going to update. So if you are using right 60 FPS monitor or uh, you need to check on your Unreal Engine settings actually. Okay, fine. So I'm going to uh, fix that. I'm going to stop it. We need to uh, fix the physics issue under project settings. So go to edit and go to project settings. So here I need to uh, search, okay, frame rate, type frame rate. The default frame rate is 30 FPS here. So the minimum and maximum is 22 and 62. So I'm going to change this to 120. So I need to change this smooth frame rate range 120. So I need to change it. So I have enabled 120 FPS in my monitor as well. Okay, so smooth frame rate. I'm going to choose the smooth frame rate. So I'm going to tick on that. So you need to enable it, smooth frame rate. Okay, and next thing, just scroll down. You can see this option, sub-stepping, okay? So here you need to enable this sub-stepping. So I'm going to enable it. Next thing, we have to change this, max sub-step delta time. So basically this will be like one divided by your FPS. So the maximum FPS. So one divided by 120. So you need to enter. So it will be automatically calculated. Okay, then the maximum sub steps, I need to set it to 12. That's it. I think now the issue will be resolved. So I just want to tell one more time. So under engine general settings, first enable the smooth frame rate, it should be enabled. And then we need to change this frame rate, smooth frame rate range. The maximum level is 120 because I'm using uh, 120 FPS monitor and then come to engine physics. So here we need to enable sub-stepping and then we need to set this maximum sub-step delta time one divided by this maximum frame rate. For example, if you're putting 60 FPS for the maximum value. So here you need to put one divided by 60. Okay, but mine is 120, right? So one divided by 120 full actually my mind will support up to 144 hertz but so i'm going to put 120 for unreal engine okay here the maximum sub steps should be 12. so that's it so automatically it will be saved the configurations so i'm going to close it so now i'm going to try this city level map already i have placed my blueprints here so this is my blueprints So this is the blueprint I just want to play. Okay, I have created the bad part. Okay, fine. So now I'm going to play this. And before that, we need to enable it, right? So I need to enable this game mode override. So it's chosen. The BP is chosen here. Okay, fine. So I'm going to tap this play. We'll see. This time I should not have any issues. It should be very smooth. And also I have connected the controller. I can use keyboard as well. See, this time, no wobbling or no jittering or no shaky effect. So 
Yes, I can play. Wow. Super cool, right? So the issue is fixed. Okay. I have set minimum world partition. So that's why it's laggy. That's not a problem. And uh, I'm going to change it to cinematic. F8 scalability to epic or cinematic. Cinematic will be good. Yes, it's changed. I think now it is very smooth. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to press this F8 and click somewhere. Yeah, you can write now. So that's it, friends. Now it is good, right? So old partition streaming performance is very slow. So that also I'm going to fix it. So pressing F8, I'm going to check on this world settings. If you want to enable right, just go to settings and click on this world settings. So it will be enabled. Enable streaming, I'm going to disable it. You are about to disable streaming all actors, yes. Enable streaming is disabled. Now I'm going to play it. Okay, yeah. I think now it's not wobbling super. So really it's awesome. I think I, okay. So if you want to disable this motion blur, you can disable it. Wow. It's now smooth, actually. It's good, right? So that's it, friends. This is the way you can fix the issue if the shaky or jittering or wobbling in your Unreal Engine. And if you want to go through the document, I'll be providing the link in the description so you can go through that. But this is the easiest way to fix it. So that's it, friends. Hope this video is very much helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Please spread the comments and feedbacks from media forms. Thank you. Bye and take care.